Hello, babies! This is Marcella Vito, and welcome back to Let's Play. Now, I got a brand new program that will finally, finally walk and download and edit and upload and all those other good things that I like my programs to do. And since I got this program, I'm, I figured why not start a game called Socially Awkward? <laughs> Seems like a pretty good idea. Well, nothing horribly can go wrong. So let's start. Keep in mind, I have never heard of this game before until just a few minutes ago, and I thought it was cute. So, why not? Hey though. <laughs> Hello, baby. Apparently I'm supposed to be a guy on this date with this lovely lady. Okay. Thanks so much for picking me up like this. Do I look okay? You look lovely. Oh yeah, you look just perfect. Good enough for me. Ha 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 ha. Actually, I'm really bad. Wait a minute. Actually, I'm in a really bad shape. Financially, I pay money to my ex-wife. <laughs> As part of our divorce settlement, among other bills. I just had no choice but to make you pay for lunch the other day. I'm really sorry. Oh! <laughs> okay. I could make a choice on what disturbing answer I can possibly say. But you know what? I'm going to try to be a gentleman and make a good impression. Oh yeah, you look just perfect. Haha. Uh -huh. I bet you say that to all the girls. Only you, baby. Only you. So hey, what's the place we're going? I haven't been here long, so I don't really know much about the nightlife around here. Well, this is big gin. Wait, wait a second. Yeah, I know, I can't talk right. Well, there's this little gem down the street called Blue Oasis. Let's go to Ben's house of oil. Those half off 3 p.m. In the dark at, in the dark of the night, does a secret granted to only of the just <laughs> Yeah, I'm a Disney fan. <laughs> Don't judge me. Oh, actually, Oasis sounds pretty cool. No, Jim, huh? Sort of out of the way. That would be great. I don't want to be around a whole lot of people tonight. Don't you? Thanks for this. I'm starving. By the way, I'm sorry, but I haven't even ask your name. I'm Eileen. Wait a second. We're on a date and you don't even know my name? Not No judgment. <laughs> no judgment. How about you? What's your name, hot stuff? Well, you can call me hot stuff. <laughs> Oh, Holly McMuffin. <laughs> oh, Holly McMuffin, huh? That's great. <laughs> I knew a guy named that. <laughs> well, well, can you possibly, well, can she possibly know another guy with my name? Things didn't go too well with him. <laughs> well, he wasn't as McMuffin as I am, if you know what I mean. No. No one knows what I mean. Aw oh, man, I'm sorry. I shouldn't bring up things like that on the first date. It's nothing personal, really. Oh, you're so sad. Do you need some snuggles? That's okay. Let's see if I can do a better than he did, huh? Gee, looks like I have my work cut out for me. Oh yeah? What did he do? Give me all the gory details. Every one of them. You knew our family's dark history and still got involved? What's wrong with you? Wow. Now I'm gonna be a gentleman this time. And the next time I play this, I'm gonna be a complete creeper. Haha. Uh -huh. Believe me, you'll be fine. Ah, oh, I got to smile. Anyway, enough about that stuff. Let's eat. 
Anything to drink? Uh, yeah. I think I'll have a beer, thanks. Mmm, beer. Don't drink, kids. Drinking leads to terrible decisions. Advertisement. Oh, wait. The more you know. Beer, huh? I have one too. Say, what's your favorite? What the hell? Oh, my favorite is Dark Horse. But I usually drink Sam Adams. Ugh. And to eat, I think I'll have a Caesar salad and a crab bisque. And you? Actually, that sounds really good. Hmm. What do you think? I have a steak. A what? Milans and pen pasta. Oh, pini pasta. Yuck. I mean, steak. I love steak. I like pasta. It's not my favorite unless... I, I'm very picky on my pastas. I'll have an autolon, a small French board, force-fed, and prepared the most beautiful, most brutal way possible. Apparently, I, if I pick that one, I'll be a serious, serious <coughs> sadistic person. <laughs> I thought a mushroom that grows that bright was bound to charge up my batteries if I ate it. And I was right. Why? Who? Who is that random? Actually, I'm pretty random, so I can't judge. Just, I can't judge. Apparently, the false answer on everything is the best choice. Wow, that sounds pretty tasty. It's steak, honey. It's always tasty. I steak is always tasty. Your food, Mr. and Miss. Thanks. Mmm. This is delicious. Hey, thanks so much for taking me out. Say, what are you fiddling with though? Uh, nothing. Nothing. You don't see anything. Oh, this? I was just telling myself on off. I don't want anyone to interrupt us. That is a good answer. I like that answer. Oh, this? I was just checking my bookmarks. Look at this great comment I left on YouTube. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, I've been on days like that. This is my knife. It's a walk of art. It has matches and fish hooks and threads and stuff in the grip. Which answer should I pick? <laughs> oh wow, that's very considerable of you. Thank you. That was pretty tasty. Thanks for the meal. Say, it's getting a little late. I live right down the street. Would you like to walk me home? Sure thing. I'll protect you. No one's gonna interrupt us with these plus one biceps. Biceps for days. I like nothing but them. So, haha, let me just casually slip my hand over on your waist. Uh huh. Oh, oh dear lord. That'll be a little too much for me. Light is but a farewell gift from the darkness to those on the way to die. <laughs> I've been waiting, Snake, for a long time, waiting for your boss. Your growth and the finality of today. That one's romantic. Well, I guess this is it. End of our first day together, huh? It was absolutely wonderful. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure. Because I am the gentleman woman. It was pretty good. Maybe next time we can do something that isn't boring. <laughs> oh, wow. What a joke. Even if a pawn becomes a queen. <clears throat> Even if the pawn becomes a queen. It is still just a playing piece. I wanted to leave my own mark in history. But by my habitations. Well, you'll understand someday. Okay. I can't wait for the next date. 
It's no problem. I'm glad you enjoyed it. That was really lovely. Let's get together soon, okay? Kiss. Mwah. Smooches. That was it. Okay, that was it. Let's play again and be a total creep. Alright. Hey, though. <coughs> Hello, baby. How you doing? Thanks for picking me up like this. Do I look okay? Well, actually, I'm in a really bad shape financially. I pay money to my ex-wife, the old ball and chain, as part of our divorce settlement, along with other bills. I just had no choice but to make you pay for lunch the other day. I'm really sorry. Uh, I'm really sorry to hear about that. But it's okay. So hey, where else this place we're going? I haven't been here all along, so I don't really know much about the nightlife around here. In the dark of the night, there is a secret granted to only in the just. That sounds pretty compelling. Yeah, I'm gonna do the voice. Thanks for this, I'm starving. By the way, I'm sorry, but I haven't even asked you your name. I'm Aline. How about you? Ah, uh, I need a name now. <laughs> Lampshade. <laughs> Lampshade. Oh, Lampshade, huh? That's great! I knew a guy named that. Things didn't go too well with him. Aw oh man, I'm sorry. I shouldn't bring up those things like that on a first date. It's nothing personal, really. <laughs> you knew our family's dark history and still got involved. What's wrong with you? I guess I have a type. <laughs> Oh, lady, you are gonna die. <laughs> anyway, enough about that stuff. Let's eat. Um, honey, I'm I'm kind of a psycho killer person. Okay, she she likes me. Hercules, Hercules. Anything to drink? Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. I think I have a beer. Thanks. Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. <laughs> they are simply returning to the natural world, that which do no longer needed. Which is no longer needed. Sometimes they even attack wounded foxes. Hey! Wow, did you know I'm into animals? I'm a bio major. You are too excited for me! Lady! These, these women nowadays, I don't understand them. And to eat, I think I'll have a seasonal salad and a crab bisque. And you? I thought a mushroom that grows that bright was bound to charge up my batteries if I ate it. And I was right! I see. I'm gonna go with the second one this time. I'll have an Autolon, a small French board, force fed and prepared in the most brutal way possible. <laughs> wow. You can sound a little less enthusiastic about that. Your food. Your food, Mr. and Miss. Thanks, um, this is delicious. Hey, thanks so much for taking me out. Say, what are you fiddling with, though? This is my knife! It walks... It's a walk of art. It has matches and fish hooks and threads and stuff in the grip. Really? That sounds interesting. Do you always bring your knife out to dinner? Only when I'm about to kill people. <laughs> Only on special occasions. When I'm about to murder people. That was pretty tasty. 
thanks for the meal. Say, it's getting a little late. I live right down the street. Would you like to walk me home while you're holding your really creepy knife that's still covered in dry blood? Possibly a human's? Light is but a fell gift from the darkness to those in the way to die. I've been waiting, snake, for a long time, waiting for your birth, your growth, and your finality of today. What, lady? Why? I'm gonna kill you and possibly snuggle you after you're dead, but mostly I'm gonna kill you. Wow, that's very profound. It touches my heart. I'm gonna touch your heart with my knife after I kill you. Well, I guess this is it. The end of our first day together, huh? You still want more? I like her. <clears throat> Even if a pawn becomes a queen, it is still just a playing piece. I wanted to leave my own mark in history, but my ambitions wall. You'll understand someday. Next date. I... I actually have something to tell you, Lampshade. The memories you have and the role you assign are burdens you have to carry. It doesn't matter if they were real or not. That's never been the point. Um... What? What? What's going on? What's going on, guys? There's no such thing in the world as absolute reality. Most of what they call it. <laughs> what? Wow, this music has changed. What is going on? I have no idea what's going on. Most of what they call is real is actually fiction. What you think you see is only as real as your brain tells you. Am I in the Matrix? Oh my god, please tell me I'm in the Matrix. Then what am I supposed to believe in? What am I going to leave behind when I'm through? We can tell other people about having faith. What we had in faith in. What we are, what we found important enough to fight for. It's not whether you were right or wrong. Comment with the music, please. I can't hear myself. But how much faith you are willing to have that decides the future. The patriots. The patriots are a kind of ongoing fiction you. Come to think of it. What? Listen, don't obsess don't obsess over words so much. Sorry. Oh lord. I got a lot of air pockets in me. Find the meaning behind those words. Then decide. You can find your own name. And your own future. Is my name Mushy Face? Decide for myself. And whatever you choose will be you. I don't know if I can. If she pulls out a red and blue pill, I will flip this. Laptop. I know you don't have much in terms of choices this time, but everything you felt, thought about during this mission is yours, and what you decide to do with them is your choice. You mean, start over? Yeah, a clean slate, a new name, new memories. Choose your own legacy! It's for you to decide! It's up to you! <laughs> well, I guess the game is over. <laughs> it was very anticlimactic. And I'm still talking in this voice. Okay. Apparently, I just dated... 
the creator of the Matrix. And uh, this thing, that was a very, very interesting game. It's free, I will, if I remember, I will try to put the link down below. If you like this goofy game, then play for yourself, see what you get. Do you get the Matrix check or do you get a regular human check that you can snuggle up to later? But it's a, it is your choice to decide for destiny! Yeah! <laughs> okay, but that's it for this episode. If you like what you see, like and subscribe, and join me for more future episodes. Until next time.